Welcome into another Dave Campbell's Texas Football Talking Point. His name is EJ Holland. My name is Greg Tepper. And we are talking Red Raiders, guns up out there in Lubbock. Uh, we're talking about Cliff Kingsbury, a guy who has kind of, kind of transformed the Texas Tech program into he's the emperor of cool now. Everybody wants to be like Cliff Kingsbury. Everybody wants to be Cliff Kingsbury. Uh, but the result, all things, all things considered, recruiting, on the field, off the field, all things considered, how would you grade Cliff Kingsbury's first 16-ish months in charge in Lubbock? Like uh, Captain Cool a little bit. Captain <laughs> Cool, yeah. yeah. The Sultan of Swag. <laughs> Sultan of Swag, that's a good one. I think he's doing all the right things. I think he's, he's flirting with moms on the recruiting trail. <laughs> he's winning games. He's getting recruits. He's. Uh, I think he's done a great job. I really do. I would give Cliff Kingsbury an A minus. Wow. Yeah, really high grade. Okay, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be a little harsher on on Mr. On Mr. Wow. Kingsbury. He's been on our cover Crushing many times. We know swag. we we like Cliff Kingsbury a lot around here, but I'm gonna give him a B minus. Okay, I think the recruiting has been excellent. He's been doing a good job of getting in and making sure these kids see him uh, in in his in you know as a guy out there on the recruiting trail. But as far as in-game management is concerned, he's only been okay. I think he's still learning the ropes of what it takes to be a head football coach. And, and you remember, they started off 7-0. and They started off like gangbusters, and everybody thinks, oh, man, here comes Texas Tech. And they lost five straight. Uh, you know, now, granted, they came back and had a great win in their bowl game, but he's got to get better at that in-game management. And beyond that, you're seeing that kind of roster turnover, a lot of guys transferring away from Texas Tech. And I wonder what kind of effect that's going to have long term. Overall, I think there's a lot of positives here. Overall, I think he's doing a, a, a good job. But right now, it's a B-minus with a little bit of a wait-and-see approach. I want to see him take that next step before I'm willing to give him an A grade. That, that's a little much. Uh, we're, we're grading him based on what he's done so far. Yes. And I think this is his, uh, you know, it's his first head coaching gig. Obviously, it's going to take time for him to learn the ropes in in-game management. I think that's where I'm more lenient on because I, under, that's, I understand that it's hard to get, get it going right away. But as far as everything else he's doing, uh, he's the face of the program, obviously. He's getting it done on the recruiting trail. I think kids transferring out, you're going to see that anytime a new head coach comes in. But he's bringing in great players. He's out there on the recruiting trail making noise. And it's not only him, but his staff. He's done a great job putting together a young, energetic staff that are loyal to Texas Tech are really part of the program. And kids understand that. And they can relate to these young guys. And that's why. Everybody's buying. I think everybody around that program is really buying into what Kingsbury is doing. Okay. I think I, I love Cliff Kingsbury. We've put him on our cover a lot. He's a he's a frequent Dave Campbell's Texas football cover boy. I think more than actually any other person. So uh, we're big fans of Cliff Kingsbury. I just want to see that next step. I want to see him make the next don't step. Take it. Okay. Take all right. All right. I, I don't I don't necessarily doubt him. I don't I don't doubt the Sultan swag. That's going to do it for us. Log on to TexasFootball.com for all things state of football. He's EJ Holland, I'm Greg Tepper, we'll see you.